hush goes over my crowd. Hush. Bennett, are you able to hang with us? Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Now, again, we have worked very, very hard on our writing skills. We also read a great story. Isaac, the story that we read earlier today, Nugget and Fang. Who are our main characters in Nugget and Fang? How did you know they were our main characters? They were included on every page. Emma. Um, the sharks um, were on every page. Not when, they, when the fish, the minnow was at school. So was there either Spang or Nugget represented on every page? Sometimes they both were. Sometimes it was just one of them. And we've been talking about parts of a letter and how to write a letter. Who do you think we're going to write a letter to today? <laughs> think about the clues, our grammar talk, we're working on letter writing. Gannon, make an inference for me. I think it's you. You think you're going to write to me? Okay, tell me why you think you're going to write to me. Because we've been talking about writing to me. You have been talking about writing to me. But I wasn't in the story this morning, although being in Nugget and Fang would be really cool. <gasps> Adarsh, who do you think we're going to be writing letters to today? Nugget and Fang. Hmm. I'm going to give you the opportunity to write letters to our characters, Nugget and Fang. Now, we really read, if I just write a letter to someone, do I just... I don't really think about it. I just start writing some words. Is that how we write letters? No. Okay, we put a lot of thought into our letters. And I know each of you puts thought into your letters because you've either written me or I've read your letters. You're very thoughtful and meaningful with your words. Now, before break, I know, again, long time ago, we talked about some thick questions. And we even have an anchor chart on our reading wall about no. thick questions. Gannon, can you remind us a little bit about fit questions? Do you see our anchor chart? Fit questions. Okay, before, I'm sorry to cut you off. Before, I want to make sure everyone's sharing the carpet. Thank you. Let's fix our legs. Practicing with the yard. All right. Go ahead, Gannon.
riders, turn your bodies back up here. Wow, I heard some great fit questions. And just to review, we said that fit questions are ones that make us stop and think. So they make us stop and think. And think. And I certainly heard some of those questions. Lily, can you give us one example of Okay, he thinks they also have a great question. Jace, um, what's another example? Are you going to save the day every day? <laughs> well, that's something the author did not answer for us. Are you going to save the day? Okay, are you going to save the day every day? And I know that it's a question, so I must end it with my question mark. Now, writers, you're going to have the opportunity to get your own letter writing paper, head back to your seat to write a letter to Nugget or Fang. And I know some of you are thinking, wait, I don't know how to spell Nugget, and I want to make sure my letter is spelled correctly. I'm going to have Nugget and Fang, the picture of the book cover, up for you. But also remember, your spelling really comes from you listening to those sounds. So don't worry if you're struggling with spelling. Really work on those strategies we've talked about in class. I'm going to be popping around to see, hmm, do you have all the parts of a letter? Do you have a thick question you're asking, nugget or fang? And we also have some other eyes and ears that might be asking you some questions about your letter writing. I'm going to give you some independent writing time. And then we will meet back up in just a little bit. If you think you are ready to independently write, can you show me? I'm going to call a group at a time. Your letter writing paper is in a couple of stacks at the back. Maddie and Isaac, go ahead and get your paper and your pencil. And you can ben and Jared, oh my goodness, they're writing on this ceiling. Ian is too, you may go. I would love for you to watch. These friends walking quietly to get their letter writing paper. Very nice job. Maddie, there's quite a few choices to choose from, so just grab one for right now. Okay, you now. can send um, Colby. Bye, Ella, go ahead. You seem very excited to get started. Now is a good time. Sydney, I'm going to call you back. Sophia, off you go. Lily, head back and get some paper. And I make sure we don't have a accident in the back where we cram all together. It's yours, buddy. Yes. Again, your question. Okay, see so on the carpet. Jace, Elena, you're ready. Off you go. Okay, if you have a question, thanks for staying on the carpet. Seth is going to cover me in his words of his letter. Off you go. Adarsh, Emma, off you go. Let me get this projector up. If you have a question, thank you for staying on the carpet. Sophie, you may go get your paper. Questions, come close. I have a question. Okay, Lily, what is your question? Just listen, because she might have the same question. Can you just put it on the board and you can put um, the underneath where it says all the little words up there so you can see it? What do you mean? Nugget and fang?
would be a thick question you could ask. Mm -hmm. If you don't have it right now, you can head back and get started and it might come to you and then you can raise your hand, okay? Okay, go ahead and get started. Yes, thank you. Can you color these? We're actually not going to color them right now. I'd rather you focus first on your task, which is...